So let's talk now about the details of what we're going to do inside. We're going to begin close to the pylorus. That's the muscle at the bottom of the stomach that lets food out of the stomach into the small intestine. That muscle marks the bottom of the stomach and we move up from that muscle several centimeters. We begin then to mobilize the, the blood vessels that come off of the side of the stomach from the bottom all the way around to the top of the stomach. We then insert a tube down through your mouth. You're of course asleep, remember, but we insert a tube down through your mouth that is about the diameter of my index finger. That tube defines the shape of this sleeve that we're making. We begin to cut the stomach just a little bit from that pylorus, that bottom muscle. We begin to cut the stomach and shape the new stomach around that tube that has been inserted down your mouth. That creates a template, if you will, that defines the size of the new little stomach. After we cut that stomach from bottom all the way up to the top, we now have two pieces. We have the tube that we're leaving behind, that's the sleeve, and then we have the portion we're removing, that's the gastrectomy. We can grab that piece of stomach through the spider device, close the arms that we had opened, and remove everything through the small incision that we had made. This is a process that takes generally about an hour or so to perform. And then we close up that small incision and you're able to wake up from anesthesia and go to recovery room.